So Muto Prime beat the crap out of Godzilla. Then Godzilla killed it. Monster Zero beat the crap out of Godzilla. Then Godzilla killed that. But who would win in a fight between Monster Zero and Muto Prime? <laughs> That's what we're doing today. This amazing video belongs to Gorgia Mania, this channel right here, and let's get into it. I'm excited to see who's gonna win. Whoever loses is a loser. This is exciting, dude. I feel like, I don't know. I... Yeah, Monster Zero, Monster Zero would decimate other Mutos for sure. Damn! Whoa! Just no chance, dude. The Uchifo, yeah, because it's trippy, because Mutos basically evolved to be the anti-Godzilla. That's why they have like an EMP and everything to counteract his atomic breath. But Monster Zero is just like the anti-everything. There's like three of them for God's sakes. That's a queen, a queen's gonna, oh damn! Queen's gonna be a beefcake. Oops. God, this is an insane battle, dude, holy crap. Are those poops? Oh, I think they're boulders. So the EMP does work on Monster Zero's gravity beam. That's, that's interesting, I like that. A, Mu a queen Muto running for their life is insane. Do you know how many people, how many female Mutos a queen has to kill to become a queen? Oh my god! Bajillions in property damage. <laughs> Just like irreplaceable destro- Woo! The queen is putting up such a good fight, she's been consistently getting whooped the entire time. Oh my god! The humanities! She's ready! That's gonna be the most wild supercharged EMP we've ever seen right there. Oh my god! Dude, a female Muto has to literally kill like hundreds of female Mutos over the course of like a hundred years to become a queen. That's why they're so incredibly tough. But if Monster Zero is about to kill it, you're gonna set them so far back on the evolutionary scale. Like a few centuries for sure. Poof. The disrespect. What an intense way to go out, dude. Gravity beamed while in a fighter jet? That dude's going to Valhalla for sure. <gasps> oh, it was calling out to Prime. I thought it mastered Prime's like screech for a second. I was like, what the hell? Oh no, oh no! Oh God! Yeah, that thing's dead now for sh- Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's gonna need that head. I feel like- pr See, Prime's supposed to be like virtually indestructible off the top of it. It's the Dragon Beetle. That's its kaiju name. That's its like lore nickname. Godzilla would have such an entertaining time watching this fight. He hates both of them so much. Woo! All three heads at once. Yeah, I think the speed at which Muto Prime's able to dig to the surface of the world would mean it's literally one of the strongest kaiju ever. It could literally shift like tectonic plates. Oh, 
Holy Jesus! <laughs> Prime is so gonna kill that freaking thing. Oh my god. She is not impressed with your feeble skull. Dude, using a giant piece of, piece of earth to block that beam would work out so well. Prime doesn't give a damn that it's regenerating. She's just gonna keep charging and killing. She's amazing. This is the world we'd live in if Godzilla wasn't here to keep everybody necessarily calm. Is that a nuke? Oh, this is the victory for Prime right here. Prime gobbles up that atomic energy like it's nothing. But Monster Zero's not from Earth. Atomic energy just does nothing for it. the sneaky oh that's beautiful oh, damn dude there's gotta be so many people in that city that are about to get nuked. I feel like they never consider that. Yeah, Monster Zero is still not from this world. I think it would naturally kill a prime. As much as it pains me to say. Oh, damn. He's gonna regenerate, though. I wonder if this video is gonna have like accurate power. I don't even know what would happen if we nuked Prime. All I know is Prime basically spends the first like quarter of its life just scavenging all atomic energy it can, all radiation to get stronger. Whoa, it's just me alone with my thoughts right now. There's no audio. Oh, thank God, I hate my thoughts. Yeah, I feel like a nuke would jack him up a bit, but he'd recover. It'd be like one good nuclear Godzilla pulse. <gasps> Prime's about to be so freaking powerful. This is beautiful. Oh, you turd licker! Monster Zero does know when to retreat. That's the thing. She knows when to piece the hell out. But so does Muto Prime. Muto Prime bails from like four Godzilla battles so it can keep powering up more and more off atomic energy. They're gonna... Oh, sweet. They're meeting in the same video. Yes. <laughs> oh, this is after Monster Zero's dead. Hardcore. So when will they meet again? Oh, when he's Mecha Godzilla. Oh, Jesus. They played with my thoughts so beautifully right there. Woof, that was incredible. That was a perfect fight. Neither of them died. Both got extremely jacked up. Even Queen Muto put up such a good fight against Monster Zero. I loved it. Leave a like on the video for more Godzilla stuff. Subscribe. Check out this amazing channel. Link down below. And I'll see you next time. <laughs>